Hello tech people. This video is all about this little powerhouse. It is one of the smallest microcontroller boards with internet connectivity, and it's extremely low cost. So today we are going to look at readily available plug and play modules for the ESP01. First thing you'll notice is that this board is not breadboard friendly, which brings us to the first module, a breadboard adapter. The ESP01 goes on the adapter, and the adapter goes on the breadboard, and you're good to go. If you are comfortable with some soldering, you can probably make one yourself, like this one. Just bend the ends of some jumper pins and solder them onto a PCB. Next one is also an adapter board, but with expanded functionality. It has onboard 3.3 volt regulator, making it compatible for both programming and prototyping. Mine is a custom-made adapter with expanded functionality, featuring GPIO pin access and indicator LEDs, but these boards are widely available in this form. It has an onboard level shifter, which means that using this board, we can communicate between ESP01 and other 5 volt boards, like an Arduino. Next up, programmers for the ESP01. There are several ways to program this board. Check out our detailed video on this, but the easiest way to program it is using this. Just plug in your ESP01, plug the programmer into your computer and upload your code. As simple as that. The most commonly available and cheaper version is this one. For this module to work, you need to solder a button on the back. Tutorial for that in the previous video. But the new version is completely automatic. You can upload your codes directly without hassle. Next one is a relay module. If your only purpose is to control a relay over Wi-Fi, you do not need an ESP32 or complicated setups. The ESP01 plugs directly on this relay module. Program your board and plug it in, and you're good to go. Next one is a DHT11 temperature and humidity sensor module. This is a simple DHT11 module with a slot for the ESP01 board. Program your ESP01 and plug it in. Then you can just get all the sensor data and send them over Wi-Fi, all in one small package. Perfect for simple weather stations. And finally, an RGB light controller module. You can plug in NeoPixel LEDs here. Then plug in your programmed ESP01. Give it power, and voila! You can also use RGB LED rings or matrices with this module. Very useful for projects like Christmas lights. These are the modules I found for the ESP01. Comment if you have seen more ready-to-use modules that work with this board. And as always, a like and subscribe would be amazing.